Well, I'm com I I'm really happy to be able to bring you this. I've been waiting for his next part, and there it is, the forge. The only thing I would say, I would seriously consider getting rid of all this fog. I would just get rid of it all. It obscures the view such a lot. And you've got spot effects in for everything you need the foundries and the smouldering lava down there you've got the spot effects for those I would really consider getting rid of that but that's me I like a nice clean image and I don't like having my view obscured that is all that's it the rest is absolutely phenomenal as far as I'm concerned and this is a complete delight I mean if anybody knows that the first level the very beginning I gave it PSM worthy so it follows that every level from that point on has to be PSM worthy because it's part of the same package it enhances my PSN worthy title doesn't it of course because it's all added to it but this is fantastic this is fantastic it's just wonderfully presented wonderfully atmospheric and I was asking uh, I was asking him how long he thinks it would take to finish this game he said if you'd went straight through it from the very beginning to the very end probably 20-25 minutes but if you collected everything in each area an hour and I would say that's about right so you know you've got a nice decent chunk of gameplay here haven't you Oh, I died. I like the lighting. It's chosen the lighting's done really well. You've got the, the cross. You've got lighting across the character. It's always good. It always creates a nice image. You see what I mean about all the spot effects? Look, you've got all these spot effects. To create the idea of smoke and smouldering. I don't think you need the fog. They're, oh, they're all over the place. Let those do the work. That's what I would do anyway. But this is exceptionally well made. I'm not going to again. I'm going to... Well, I don't know. I don't know. Because this is a game that actually relies on you getting everything. Oh, damn it. This is a game that relies entirely, it's not finished, don't forget. On collecting everything in the level, I don't think ending the level is a problem, to be honest. But it's got one more level after this, I, th I believe. And then that's the end of this. But you'll see what happens, I think. I think that's what I'll do, I think I will take you through to the culmination of this level. I like that, you see how he comes through that door and immediately walks over open this valve, opens this valve and then turns towards the exit and you're set to go. Just those little touches of convenience. They're all the little things that are important. That set these games apart from others. that smouldering foundry out there it's quite a complex level quite a lot of geometry in it <coughs> and I do like this character he's created it's awesome now there's an egg I think by looks of it hidden around here oh yes you'll see that I've got a pitiful amount of eggs by the end of this so like I said, even though I'm going to finish this level you're going to realise there's lots of little hidden places that I've not even gone near.
and you all you must have all seen the botanical garden part which is also very big a very lengthy section I like this smooth camera work too one thing I would say is just just let me get hold of this cam control this camera a little earlier because look I've only just got control and there's the platform already and I have to wait a long time for it to come back round again just let the character the, 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 uh, crea the creator the player have control of the character a little earlier so he's got plenty of time to think about what he's got to do and jump onto that platform that's all though I mean look at it though and isn't it just marvellous look at it I'm tempted to go down there that looks like it's something hidden I've got I've got to check it out now haven't I I've got to check this out probably should have done that yes I should have done that <laughs> never mind that's fine Get me through there. I've got to negotiate this again. Oh, have they stopped? Interesting. We'll go through here. I mean, what are we going to be seeing in the. Oh dear. Maybe. Maybe that's a mistake then. Aha. Uh -huh. So I can't see I don't seem to be able to progress. Hopefully, am I in the right place? Am I in the right place? Oh yes, that's it. <laughs> Thank goodness for that. Let's do this again. It's just a fantastic, just fantastic. People I mean, seriously. We're going to see legitimate games made with dreams, folks. Don't let anybody put you off thinking that. We are. It's already happening. Just because the mainstream media choose to ignore all the unique creations and focus entirely on copies of IPs. That perception of dreams is still that it's not capable. Because they're not, they're just not helping, are they? I, I really didn't. I don't like the mainstream media, as you, you, you probably guessed now. <laughs> I just don't like them. I just, it's so, un, it's so uncreative. Woo. There you see. I mean, like I said, I've gone straight to the end. You'll see how very, how very few of the eggs I've actually collected when I finish this level. So the objective isn't just to finish the level, remember, the objective is to grab everything in the level. I just want to see this nice little cutscene, nice idea, 10% completed. So there's so many little, little hidden areas I never found. so we go into the last section of the game which isn't made yet but it will be absolutely certain of it and we'll uh, go down the lift absolutely fantastic absolutely fantastic this for me is, again, it's one of those titles that I look at and I think, yeah, this is what, this is what I hope Dreams would be doing. And it's doing it, folks. I love it. I love this. So thanks for watching. Very well. Tootle Pip. Au revoir. And all that good stuff. And if you liked it, feel free to like. If you liked it a lot, feel free to subscribe or even tickle my bell and please comment I do love reading your comments and share because YouTube are useless at the moment they're not helping us little channels out 
But, you know, we do our best, cover as much as we can and get as much exposure for the creators. Hopefully send some traffic towards their creations. So yeah, thanks for watching everyone. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.